In the next few minutes, you're going to learn how to fill up and set up your uh, case management spreadsheet as quickly as possible um, with all the shortcuts you uh, may or may not have known. So stick around. In this case, we're going to start from blank, and we're also going to use a student file, a fake one, because I don't work in school district, even if I did, I don't want to go to jail. So, um, and this is not something you want to type. So let's set up ID, last name, first name, right? Um, age, grade, now uh, date of birth, just for example, and also school and compliance date, which we don't have right now. Now you notice that it doesn't, uh, it's default settings don't permit you to actually, you know, it doesn't fill in, doesn't fit in right. So what I do is I click one of the cells up here, one of the columns, control A, right click, and I want to basically do column width, suggested to 17. Now you have something that works. So now you don't have to adjust it one by one. You can, you can do it for everything. I'm going to show you a slow way to do it. Slow way would be to find a file, which you know takes forever. Here, click, drag, right click. I'm just going to, you know, right click it. All right, copy. And then basically here, paste, which is actually not the best idea. It just takes a very long time. I'm sure you did more efficiently do it. You want to know your alt tab, switching programs back and forth very quickly. Now, now you're going to double click that hides a word, control C, alt tab. And I'm not going to copy in here. I'm going to copy up here. And then, you know, I got to do that. That's pretty much it. Now, what happens if you forget and you copy here instead of here? It's not the end of the world. Control V. I got to help. I could do Control and then M. It's called merge pasting. That's the, you know, it's a few extra seconds if you uh, ask how to mess it up. Let's delete this now. It doesn't look too great. Just remove the cell. So, here. So let's select the ID. Click here. Right, so I'm, I'm copying now by default, Excel actually makes it this small. I like to make it a little bit bigger just so I can see more of the formula and for other reasons I'll, click, I'll get into in future tutorials. So I'm copying up there, that's how I know I'm doing correctly. Five, I don't need to copy and paste that date of birth. Now, there's a difference between single click, double click, which highlights the word, and triple click, which gets the whole cell. For something like this, you want to triple click one, two, three, control C, alt tab, and then basically there. Oh, well, whoops, I messed it up so. And then here, same thing. What kind of a uh, five-year-old with denim with records is that? I have no idea. Right, so triple click, click up there, copy and paste. If you magically mess it up, control M. And that's it. Let me know uh, what other tutorials you want me to see, want to see as a school psychologist or just any other clinician. And uh, let me know if you have any questions. Leave, leave a like, share, comment, you know, address.